Basements, the saturated yards, the soggy start to our summer is leaving many Western New Yorkers waterlogged. One neighborhood is mopping up sewage, and a restaurant could be to blame. We begin tonight with News 4's Al Vaughters. Al? Don, Buffalo Sewer Authority crews cut through a clog and a storm sewer line not far from a North Buffalo restaurant. That line was also filled with tree roots. Is it possible the clog was caused by the restaurant? Officials are only saying it's possible. Like your arteries. Sewer authority workers searching the storm drains under Linden Avenue with a small video camera, searching for the cause of clogged sewers that backed up into basements earlier this week. Nancy Torres is mopping up her basement after rainwater came bursting through a floor drain. Oh, it was shooting up, just shooting up from the hole. And right, up, right up, up through the floor in, into and the, the basement? And the side of the, where the hole is, shooting up. Homeowners were frustrated. From the sewer. <laughs> hey, back up. <laughs> where did it come from? City officials promised to find some answers, and they did. The camera finally located the problem. Sewer Authority General Manager David Comerford told us it was tree roots and grease. That's right, grease. We found some grease at the end of the line, probably from the restaurant, which would clog up the line, and we found some tree roots. So the combination of both of them probably uh, restricted flow. Comerford told us they don't have conclusive evidence the grease came from Denny's, so there won't be any action taken. Next, a crew used a high-pressure water hose from this truck to flush out the grease and bust through the tree roots. Comerford told us the storm drain should be fine now. Do you think that's a possibility? It might be. Who knows? We'll know in a couple more days if it rains so hard again. Longtime Linden Avenue homeowner Antonina Volpe seems surprised grease could back up storm sewers. Now, what do you think? Possible. I don't know. From where? From uh, the only restaurant that we have is Danny. I don't know. Now, officials at Denny's told us they dispose of their grease in a way that shouldn't clog sewer lines. Sewer Authority Manager David Comerford told us the grease had built up over a period of time, and it's possible it could have come from other sources. Alvarez News 4 at 5.